Hello everybody, my name is Robin and welcome to Student Vlogs hashtag Swansea Uni. Today I'm going to be taking you all around Swansea from Uplands to Swansea Marina to go see all the Dylan Thomas exhibitions. Now in case you don't know who Dylan Thomas is, he is an incredible poet that was born and bred in Swansea. He's written some fantastic work and I think one of his most famous is Under Milk Wood which is a playwright and it's beautiful. I myself am a massive poet fan and so coming to Swansea, living here and being able to be in the heart of where Dylan Thomas grew up is insane. I would definitely say that Swansea is really proud to have Dylan Thomas as one of their icons and so they've dedicated a lot of work to it. We'll be visiting three places. One is Uplands and the Dylan Thomas House in Uplands. Two is the Dylan Thomas Theatre and then three is the Dylan Thomas Centre. So let's go! To get to Dylan Thomas's birthplace, you head up Condonkin Drive, follow the Dylan Thomas Trail to the house where you'll see a sign leading you there. Now you do have to pay for entrance and unfortunately you had to book this in advance, so I was not able to enter the home, but it was lovely to come see anyway. So I've just arrived at the Dylan Thomas Theatre and I've had a little read of this board. From what I can gather, Dylan Thomas worked at the Swansea Post and wrote articles for them, but then left and joined his sister to be a part of the committee uh, in the little Swansea Theatre. On the 50th year marking the anniversary of his death, the theatre and the Dylan Thomas Society joined together to create what is now today Dylan Thomas Theatre. So I've just spoken to the staff here who are absolutely lovely and found out a bit more about this theatre. So it did open in 1983 and Dylan and the committee started playing their plays in Mumbles where they created all their playwrights. And one of the committee members originally acted with Dylan Thomas and she's still a part of the committee. She's turning 99 next year. <laughs> but as you can see behind me, this theatre is just full of art. <laughs> like true history, art, culture. Reading passages from Dylan Thomas and recognising, oh, I, I know these places in Swansea. And just seeing all the history behind it, it's, it's beautiful. I'd definitely say you'd have to come here to really experience what Dylan Thomas is like and get chatting to the staff as well. They know so much information. Coming to the Dylan Thomas Centre, you walked around in a circle of a timeline of his career and lifetime. Now, what was really cool is that the whole thing was really interactive. Like you can look through this little peephole and see a bit of art or pull on the string and see a bit more art. And then you can look around and read more of his work and his history. But there's something else. This is the, my favourite um, writings by Dylan Thomas, so let's have a listen. Do not go gentle into that good night. Old age should burn and rave at close of day. Rage, rage against the dying of the night. Though wise men at their end no dark has right, because their words had forked no lightning, they do not go gentle into that good night. Good men the last wave by, crying how bright their frail deeds might have danced in a green bay. Rage, rage against the dying of the light. Wild men who caught and sang the sun in flight, and learned too late they grieved it on its way. 
Do not go gentle into that good night. Brave men near death who see with blinding sight. Blind eyes could blaze like meteors and be gay. Rage, rage against the dying of the light. And you, my father, there on the sad height, curse, bless me now with your fierce tears, I pray. Do not go gentle into that good night. Rage, rage against the dying of the light. So for context, that poem was written by Dylan Thomas to his father, who was dying at the time, and it was beautiful. It does say here, listen to Dylan Thomas read the complete poem. So I'm going to have to check, but that might be Dylan Thomas, Dylan Thomas's original voice. I thought it was beautiful, I'm going to listen to it again. If you did enjoy this video and feel like you learned something about Dylan Thomas, then please like this video, comment down below, and subscribe to the student vlogs hashtag Swansea Uni YouTube channel. Bye guys!